let's take a look down under with this week's Fish Eye View, sponsored by Mercury, number one on the water. After 25 years of underwater filming, you might say we've learned a thing or two. More than anything else, it's the fine line between success and failure when getting fish to bite. While some species are more finicky than others, few compare with the moodiness of largemouth bass. When it comes to tossing hard baits for these fish, you really have to keep an open mind and try all the established tricks. This past season, we conducted an intense study on largemouth behavior. We visited several locations on the Trent Canal system in Ontario. Accessible, heavily fished, and highly fertile, we concentrated our efforts in weedy, sheltered back bays. Choosing the best of the best, a sabeel jointed minnow, we bent down the hooks. What we learned is that subtle changes in action make all the difference in the world. When largemouth just look or follow, stop and give it that extra punch to trigger a strike. What we also realized is the value of making multiple casts to the same place. Start with a bold statement, then slow it down or stop altogether. Try everything imaginable before moving on. Fact is, most of us choose hard baits and cranks to cover water in a hurry. In reality, these products just might have their greatest value as a finesse bait.